Okay, you're making, you're yeah. making this your own issue. Say it with me. You're not doing me. You're, you're doing, doing yourself! yourself. Cinderella OG and welcome back to my channel. So as y'all can see, I promised y'all I was gonna What is the problem? <laughs> so today, as I promised, we are going to have an all girls everything asking for a friend. Yes, I have some beautiful ladies here with me, and y'all have sent us questions for you to add or for us to answer, and we're going to serve y'all with just that. But before we get into those questions, I'm gonna let these beautiful ladies go ahead and introduce themselves. I'm Nama. I'm Elizabeth. I'm Amara Chi. Chinonye. I'm Jennifer. Bianca. And I'm Cinderella OG. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome. Ciao Bella. Hey, how you doing? So today, we're gonna go ahead and get right into these hot questions. And uh, I'm gonna leave everybody's information in the description box down below. So if you wanted to see where these hot ladies are residing, you know, they're all single and they're hot and ready to mingle. So if you want to connect with them, man, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. But if you want to connect with any of them, all their YouTube channels, all their Twitters, Instagram, Snapchats, all that will be in the description box down below. So with that being said, let's get right into the questions. This letter is titled, Unintentional Cougar. Um, so do y'all want to give them a name? Um, um, Amaka. Amaka, okay. <laughs> so Amaka says, hey Cindy, I trust you completely with this mess. I'm a junior in college, I'm 20 years old, and I have an extreme baby face. Most people guess I'm 12 to 15. I've been taking karate for about a year now, but there's this kid who's 14 and keeps staring at me. Now instead of enjoying karate, I cringe because he's so damn obvious and that's embarrassing. Other kids 14 to 16 approach me as well. What is your advice for how to deal with advances from minors? And do you have any advice on how to look older? First of all- Wait, wait, sincerely, a grown woman who isn't treated like one. Ooh. First of all, you should just tell them the person your age, honestly, <laughs> and carry yourself in a mature way. Yeah, yeah. 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 act like a, if you carry a child. yourself like a lady, yeah. they'll know you're a lady. Yeah. Exactly. No yeah. matter how short you are or how round your face is, you carry yourself like a woman. <laughs> I mean, that's what she said. She has a baby face. Yeah. Yeah. She said she didn't say round. Oh, I, that's what I assume from a baby face is that your face is round. Maybe it's maybe it's chisel. Maybe it's a chisel baby face. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't try to grow too fast. She's not She's 20. 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 I mean, right not. now, maybe it's a problem, but later on in life, it may be. It may be a yeah. good thing. It might be a good thing. You'll be like, yeah. uh, maybe you mean. should find a karate class for adults. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah, for that. For I'm saying. <laughs> I'm saying. Because look, she would never have that problem. I mean, they may be like, like, can I see some ID? But it's better to ask for ID than to have like a 15 or 14 year old approach you, like, you know, hey, I'm trying to get on some, you know, slummy, slummy thing. I don't think she should do too much to try to look older. Like, you don't need to wear like sexy things or a whole bunch of makeup. You don't even need to wear makeup at all. Yeah. Just carry yourself like a woman and mm -hmm. you should be good. Is that same Whatever way? attitude that you have, like how you treat yourself is how what 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 kind of a people that you will attract. Mm -hmm. exactly. So if you treat yourself like that that grown woman, then people will treat you like that grown woman. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. So we hope we help you out that Hillary. Hey, so hey, Hillary hey, says, hey, hey Cindy hey. and Texas College. Um, I don't know where she got that from. I know how you like it short and to the point, mm -hmm. so let's get into it. Yes. Thank you, Gail. So there's this boy who lives next door. I guess you could say that he has a bad reputation with girls, as in cheating in a relationship for sex, etc. I've known him for a long time and we've been really good friends. He's always saying he will marry me and be the father of my children, but I don't know if I should trust him. He swears that he'll change for me and he hasn't been with anyone for a while. Question, should I believe him and give him a chance or keep him the boy next door? Lots of love. Don't block your bus. Yeah, yeah, don't block it. Tell him what's up and if he, you know, messes up, get I don't know. I mean, Good just enough. just tread lightly. Mm -hmm. Like I always feel like um, people's passion really define them exactly. for the most part. Yeah. So it's like, I mean, 
yeah okay he maybe has a history of doing whatever whatever but he didn't do that he, whatever yeah to her. exactly yeah. he didn't do it to you so just just take it with a grain of salt don't like you know go all like googly eyed over words yes. just like if you really like like him as a person like regardless of all the like fluffy words that he uses if you really like him as a person and you know, you can maybe see something happening. Yeah, give it a shot. Mm -hmm. And if he's been a player boy and he's now settled to come and now be chasing you, obviously he wants you. So. Exactly. Men will really change who they want to change. Yeah. Exactly. Well, I feel like if you actually like him, you should pray about it. And then let God tell you. Take it to God. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Take it to God. Take it to God. Yeah. 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 Definitely yeah. give him a chance. As they said, don't block your blessings, but. Don't be naive about it. Yeah. Don't open your ears and open your eyes. Mm -hmm. first, Shine your eye. Yeah. Shine your eye, but don't don't be paranoid. Yeah. Honestly. Because yeah. then don't. that's where like things can go left. Yeah, can Who's that girl that. texting your phone? Yeah. Don't be that girl. Don't like that. Don't like her. Next. Oh, I like this one. My man left me for clout. says, hey Cindy, I'm going to make this short and sweet. Thank you. I was talking to this guy um, for a school year and everything was good until four, uh, the month four or five hit. First of all, that's your problem. You were talking to him for four to five months. months. No. Ah, you thought. Um, but anyway, <laughs> before he was affectionate with me in public uh, and didn't seem ashamed of me. Then, after his pictures on social media, I started getting him some attention. It seemed as though he hated being associated with me. Hey, you know what? This one is Oh my gosh. He loved uh, girls quoting his picture, saying that he was fine, putting heart emojis, wow. <laughs> heart eye emojis, and retweeting every single tweet mm -hmm. when we were in a serious talking phase, which I felt was very disrespectful. Which hmm. is. We finally split after I was finally oh fed up. <laughs> she <laughs> said split. What was wrong? 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 We finally split after I was fed up with him leading me on and never wanted to claim me. Thank God. But now I have an issue. We have to be around the same social circle. I don't want to be rude, but I don't want to not talk to him at all. Um, and seem like a B word. What is my the best dear. way to handle this? And yes, I was naive, but I've learned my lesson. I definitely say if he left you for a clout, he's not the one. He's not not the one. one. If he left you for a clout, he has no substance in himself. And he had no respect for you in the first place. That's all. He just seems extremely like young minded. Yeah. Like, yeah. Why are you so geeked off a of retweet? He just like right. puberty. Retweets? Social media? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He just like, got a, a couple of people don't hairs and he thinks he's all shit now, man. That's that's what what a couple of hands on the <laughs> yeah, And at the end of the day, why are you so pressed on you people being the same group? Why, why do you that care? That really doesn't matter. Honestly, yeah, live your life. Live your life. Why do you care? Why do you care? Right. You don't have to associate with him. Yeah. You don't have to associate with him. No, what do you mean? I don't want him to think I'm a bitch. What? You have no business of what he thinks. <laughs> Keep it moving. <laughs> in life, you're going to run into people who like you and people who don't like you. You may be in the same circle as people who like you and people who don't like you. Just do you and stay focused on you. Asking for a friend, no for real, this is for a close friend, not for me. Uh, okay, girl. Okay. So this sure. is the friend situation. What should we name him? Uh, Madison. Okay. Madison says, okay. I'm a 24 year old and I have been dating my boyfriend for close to five years. She's how old? 21? 24. 20, 24. Oh, 24. Okay. For five years? Five years. Okay. Dating. That's marriage. Wow. I mean, boyfriend. No, no but it, it gets started, If you started dating at 19, that's... Yeah. It gets bad, though. Okay, 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 let's hear it, let's hear it. We've never discussed marriage <gasps> until I forced Shrek the conversation a few months ago. He's not the one. Oh, he's not. He's definitely not. We don't need to go. We don't need to go. What? Bro. Y'all should be talking about marriage. You're 24. What are they eating? Yes. 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 So, he said that he wants to have his own place for at least two years before getting married. Which would make it a possible total of seven years of dating before he possibly pops up the question. Nope. I'm not trying to force him to propose, but at the same time, I don't want... 
I want to make sure that I'm not wasting my years on someone who hasn't vocalized a clear future with me. Am I wasting my time or should I stick it out? P.S. She is African American and he and so the, like their culture is kind of different than ours. Wait, he's Nigerian? I, I, they, no, no, no. they didn't say what he was, but she's African American, so I'm okay. guessing he's African American too. Okay. okay. No. Honestly, it hasn't been talked about now. Yeah. If it you're in a healthy, one. a healthy relationship, y'all should have had one conversation. Yeah. At least, At least one. one. Yeah. <laughs> The only conversation they've had about marriage is her forcing. Yeah. 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 And you yeah. should yeah. never have to force like, anything. Yeah. Yeah. If, if five, years, years, five years in, he, hey. Maddie, no. he's not mad over you. Nah. <laughs> he's not gonna nah. ask. No so yeah, yeah. 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 And, and mama, you're 24, huh? Yeah. Yeah. No, honestly. You're 24. You're 24. You're 24. What? You're no. basically just in a relationship for fun. Mm -hmm. right. yeah. We don't do that. Yeah. Yeah. We don't have yeah. no. And you people are adults. You're in the you're in the marrying age. What do you mean? I he, what? he said he I wants his place for like a, a place by himself for two years. Yeah, he wants yeah. a bachelor. Why? 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 Honestly, that that is what we call. That's what we call. In my country, we call that an excuse, baby. He doesn't. He's he's. Bringing up reasons of like not wanting to think about marriage. Honestly, if you were the one that he wanted, he would have been talked to about been it. Been talked about it. Like exactly. long oh, time ago. No five sense. whole years. Uh, what a man wants, out. what a man wants will go get. Exactly. exactly. He doesn't he want, want you. He he want want you. more into Sorry. you than you're into him. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Yeah. That's how it works. I personally yeah. believe that for a relationship to really work, the man has to want the girl more than the girl. Yeah. Yeah. I think that because too. the girl will always open her eyes and be like, yeah, yeah. okay, I'm ready. But the man has to want you. And you yeah. cannot chase the man. Don't chase the 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 Okay. <laughs> <laughs> she, she wants to be anonymous, so give her a name. For the next video, y'all give yourself oh, no, names, okay? Yeah. Veronica. Veronica. Xenon. Oh, like what the? She said Xenon. I know. That's a girl looking at her. That's not a Disney show. Yeah, yeah. Zoom, zoom, zoom. My heart go boom, boom. My supernova girl. You know me. Hi Cindy, I love your videos and all the wise, wise advice that you and your guests give. Thank you, we're here today. So, I was recently in a relationship for a year and four months. I left because it was uh, one-sided and toxic in many ways. Mm -hmm. Throughout the relationship, my ex didn't give uh, do much to make me feel special. He didn't get me a gift for our one year. I got a previously written note for Valentine's Day. Well, it's not about material. God, really? Are we no, we got a written note. A written note. That's not even material. Oh, that's shit. Oh, he's trifling. Yeah. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my
he needs, not. he needs to find a way, the same way he's able to pay his rent and go enjoy with pay his friends. friends. That's the same way he needs to go and pay football. for you. She yeah. says she pays for everything. everything. That's, that's not a thing. Who's the female and who's the male? Yeah, basically, that's the thing. What did he bring to the table? Nothing. No, he he wasn't even planning their dates. So that means she was going out of her way. Dates don't cost money. They don't. A lot of dates don't cost money. Anything's a date. No, anything is a date. Like like real talk. Even if it means picking small, small flowers yes. that you see on the street. <laughs> 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 that's okay. huge. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. thoughtful. Yeah. 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 It's the little things that count. Yeah. Yeah. No, but it's, it's, <laughs> no, it's, 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 no, but like outdoor events. That's cheap, cheap. Yeah. He can take you to the park. Fast. He can take you to um, Go to a food lake. truck. Yes. Go walking. Um, what is that, baked potatoes? Y'all can go work out. Work out. Y'all can study. Work out. There's a lot. Y'all could go to Bible study. Yeah. Yes. That's cute. That's actually nice. Y'all could watch Nama's videos and chill. Watch my channel. Y'all could watch, watch Lizzie's videos and chill. Yeah. Yes. Y'all could watch Amarachi's videos yes. and chill. Duh. Y'all could watch my videos There's and options. chill. And y'all can watch Queen Jen's reality show and chill. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, except she yeah. doesn't have one. There's options, baby. There is options. But no, real talk, options. like, don't feel bad, Shadi. <laughs> and for him to say <laughs> that you are ungrateful, <laughs> my friend, Anything that he's ungrateful. He I'm gonna. He has. I'm just gonna go ahead and quote the color purple right now. Till he does right by you, everything he even think of gonna fail. Until you do right by me, everything you think about is gonna crumble. Uh, oh, <laughs> girl. Uh, okay. Don't feel guilty. Honestly, don't. Because honestly, I feel like in relationships, people are like, oh, who should pay for this? Who should pay for that? It's all about effort. Yeah. yeah. And like, honestly, it should be joint. Who should be? Who's putting in effort? Because you said, so. regardless of like, oh, who's paying or whatever, he's not even looking up any days. He's literally just it's showing up. Yeah. Does he even shower before he comes? <laughs> <laughs> Is he wearing your typical um, Adidas joggers when he walks out? Oh, oh, the same way that he doesn't have it, the same way you don't have it. So stop mm. coughing that money. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. You don't want to waste your money on a broke girl. No. You probably waste your money on another female, to be honest. Honestly. To be honest. That's honestly. Honestly. What I'm relying on. What I've realized is like men, men don't like once they get past a certain age, they don't really be broke. So they yeah. don't. They're not like completely broke. So you have money. He doesn't want to spend his money on you. Hi, Key. No, there's honestly. a lot of like college students be having some money. They're they they so not broke. They be a having lot, enough. Exactly. A lot of college students have some type of self drive and ambition. So he's mm -hmm. hustling somewhere. Mm -hmm. yeah, he's I'm just fine. not spending any of it on you. Exactly. Which mm -hmm. is very unfortunate. Very. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can't use her real name. Um. The African people at my school are messy. Hey! <laughs> that's that's right. Right. I can relate. That's everywhere. And, yeah, yeah, facts. New? And I don't want to be in drama, so I hang out with my friends who are from another ethnic group. But sometimes I feel like I should doubt my decisions because I feel like there are people, they are my people, and make up a part of who I am. What do I do? Should I become friends with them and stay out of the mess, or just keep away? Also, thanks for the advice in advance. Honestly, just do what makes you yeah. happy, mm -hmm. and you know. Because being African, it, it comes with mess. It, so you it just matters. gotta, like, it does. You just gotta no, dip it in really and dip out. You know, just yeah. keep your distance. Just fill it out. Mm -hmm. If you don't like it, yeah. move to the next. You really group. don't have to exactly. much in those groups. You just exactly. hang out. Yeah, fun. you don't. Have to you know, just show face a little, yeah. say hi and bye. But don't, it's not everything don't, you don't tell everyone, your so yeah, don't exactly. share your business. You know, just don't, don't share your don't get business. too close, because everyone is not your friend. They may yeah. have a new face, but girl. And that, honestly, that's for any community, not honestly, just African. African, black, exactly. and white people too. The that's same exact. people that smile in your face and the same people that will talk behind it your back. There's plenty yeah. of so. But honestly, don't have like a bitter outlook on life oh, because yeah. of that. Like, mm -hmm. everybody's just out to get me. Just do you, like, Make your own moves, like just don't worry about that. Yeah, Nigerian or not Nigerian, African people <laughs> or whatever are messy, but I mean, just not all of us are messy. Yeah, not, not all. all. Not all. And at the same, point, the at the same time, yeah. don't isolate them because you're gonna need them at one yeah. point. Yeah, yeah. Really really I'm personally here for diversity, yeah. so yeah. make friends with everyone Everybody. else in your school. And mm -hmm. if the Africans aren't working for you right now, in due time they'll work for you. Yeah. It's but true. All, it's true. But but honestly, you might like it. If you find yourself in that situation, well, <laughs> good luck, Charlie. <laughs> Ooh, oh, yeah, that's a good one. Juicy. Let's give her a name. 
Couture? <laughs> couture. Ooh, juicy. I kind of like that. Couture. Couture. Okay. So, okay. Couture, couture says, couture. my boyfriend won't tell his mom about me. Um, it's it's too big of a deal. Well, it depends on it. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Too big of a deal. We're gonna be on the same. I think I'm pretty sure, as Nigerians, as Nigerians, we're all gonna be on the same page. Uh, I'm not bringing you home if there's so, no marriage inside. Anyway, yeah. hey Cindy, my boyfriend and I have been going out for four months now. <laughs> four months? Okay, let's, let's continue. Let's give that chance. Let's give okay. that a chance, man. But anyway, they've been going out for four months. Nope. Um. And everything is great, but the only thing is he won't introduce me as his uh, to his mom as his girlfriend. I try to understand, but he tells me that uh, his mom is very strict and won't allow him to Sounds have right. uh, any relationships and wants him to focus on uh, building his career and staying clear of relationships. Plus, she already has his mindset that um, she, he should date and marry a Ghanaian girl. She's African American. Oh. Oh. That is why. Wait, she, she, Okay, wait, finish, finish on her. Okay. He has given me the chance to meet her at his college graduation celebration, but said that he would introduce me as his friend for their <laughs> for this first encounter. I'd rather not. Okay. Yeah. To be honest. I mean, it's, it's not thing. it's not like I'm a secret because his brothers and friends know about me. But I just don't know what to do. Give him some more time to stick up to his mom and tell her about me or act like just his friend, since he wants to introduce me as that. Honestly, nobody's sticking up to an African parent. No. <laughs> no. no. Not over those are wasting my time. And it's four no, months. No, Couture, honestly, he, his family sounds like my family. Fast. Four months is nothing. That is not He's not nothing. introducing you. There's still so time to dash you away, bro. Like, like well. you can meet the siblings, you can meet the friends, right. but you won't meet the you're parents until you're yeah. that person. Even three Coming years, from though. a Ghanaian family, <laughs> like an African I'm family, not gonna lie. that's a reason why. No, yeah, exactly. Y'all can be together for years, and you still won't marry them all. So don't take this too personal. Don't take it personal. Personal because if he's not talking about marriage, then you're probably never gonna meet her. Yeah, to yeah. be honest, I'll yeah. never bring a, a boy to my house if there's no never. marriage inside. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Like I've actually had that? like some friends who aren't African who date Africans. They're like, oh, well, he's met my mom. He's met all my family. And I'm like, fam, you don't meet nobody unless y'all walking down the hall. Not exactly. Exactly. It's, like, it's not that it's, it's not that you're like they don't take you seriously. It's not that like something's wrong with you or they're embarrassed of you. It's just mm -hmm. that that's just not how we do. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. just not how we do. At all. So just try to understand the culture. Should I follow my heart or my family? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of these people. I'm tired of these people. Who's coming up with these captions, though? <laughs> hey, Cinderella. I've been with this guy for a year now, and my family disapproves of him. Since we first met, he was smoking and drinking a lot. But now, he doesn't do any of those things, and he goes to church, and he has changed for me. But my family still disapproves of him because he is not of my culture and my parents, oh, he's not of the culture that my parents like. And if I don't break up with him, he can't, uh, I can't come home. But the thing is, if I break up with him, he'll go back to his habits. Wow. I pray for our relationship and I pray that one day my parents will approve of him. What should I do? That's a, uh, what's her name? We have to marinate that. Wait, 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 what is her name? She has a lot going on. Yeah, that's a lot. So let, let's just call her Lola. <gasps> let's call her Lola. Lola! Lola, that's a difficult one, but I would say that if he's putting all this pressure on you that if you leave him, he's going to go back to his ways, that means he doesn't want it for himself. Yeah, exactly. So you need, to, you need to tell him to find God first mm -hmm. or find his ways first, and then he can figure out if he wants to be with you. Yes. He shouldn't put that pressure on you and you shouldn't feel like you have to go out of your way to create him into a better person just for yeah. the sake of fitting into your life. Because that that's you clearly leave. not his life. Because so, honestly, that's an act. That's what kind of an act. Sick ultimatum is that? I'm, yeah. I'm not going to change if you don't stay with me. Come on! Like if they're like a drug addict, like you're like, leave! I get it, No, but honestly, Better, You're Don't willing to that. lose living with your parents, Every rent free, rent free, rent free. free. Every for that boy. Ha! Ah, I would never. Well, I mean, it depends. Though. Mean? You can't say you would never. It depends on. I would never. I know myself. No. Rent free. If I'm not having friends. money, why would I do that? Yes, honestly. Why yeah. would I put myself in that situation? Another I feel like Michael love this situation. Free well, honestly, I just free rent. Free rent. There's other fish in the sea. Thank. Okay. Well, honestly, I'm trying to figure out. But are those fishes for you though? 
Do you think that's this fish is This one's definitely not See, she's it. allergic to catfish and she doesn't even know. <laughs> she needs to go to the salmon, the tilapia. He really is catfish. He really is catfish. And your parents probably know best. Yeah, honestly. He's sick. Your parents know best. All those mad people that your parents, like, will tell you, I see evil in you. Yeah. But listen, it so, might sound harsh, but they know what they're talking about. They know yeah. exactly what they're talking about. And there's just already red flags. Like, why yes. is he gonna revert back? Even to if he yeah. reverts back, my friend, you don't feel guilty because it's yeah. not your problem. He's an adult. It's, it's, it's really not your yourself. issue. Honey, you're turning this into your issue. You're making this your own issue. Say it with me. You're not doing me. You're doing yourself. Next, because. Karachi <laughs> <laughs> is ready. <laughs> okay, I like this one. I like this one. So, let's give her a name. She needs a name. Damn, y'all, give yourself a name. Meredith. Meredith. I love her. Meredith, Meredith, Meredith Gray. Gray. I hope she's Gray. smart. Gray. <laughs> Meredith Gray says, Hey. Hey. Hi. 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 <laughs> Someone I used to talk to recently tried to come back to me. I asked why they didn't take me serious um, the first time, and he said that he was still in his hoe phase and wasn't ready. He is a very well-known D1 player from my city. Okay. So, <laughs> that give him <laughs> so how do I how do I know if he's just trying to play me? to just use me or if he's really interested. He could really have anyone he wants. Another thing is that we often fall out because I always tell him that he's playing with me and I can't take him seriously. So he just went ghost on me. Now, so did I ruin it or was I eventually gonna get played? He did you a favor. He did honestly, you a favor, honestly. honestly. You were eventually surely, going to get played. He's, he's gonna your time. He's a D1 player. He's trained to play. Yeah. <laughs> hey, not too much on the D1. Not too much on the D1. You lost me at that D1, so does that give him yeah, points? I don't know. You don't want to give him any cool D1, yeah, like, is he going to the league? Yeah. I think, I think her point. Like, I think her. I think her point in saying he was D1 is that he can have one whoever he wants. I don't, I don't give it that. Not all D1 players can have whoever they want. That's true. That's true. I think her. I think she was trying to say like he's. He's somebody. He's yeah. yeah. He's somebody. Yeah. Everybody's somebody. Everybody's, Everybody's somebody. Everybody's somebody. Exactly. Yes. That just goes to show her character. You're looking for status. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. well, not too much on Meredith, though. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is? No, but the thing is, your... Meredith, my problem is your question should not have been, like, your question was too lengthy for him to already have left you. Yeah. So, no, no, I'm problem. not saying, yeah, no, honestly. <laughs> I'm not saying that in a bad way. I'm just saying everything you said before was invalid because he's already gone. Yeah. So, so he why are you crying? He, 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 he already, already hit okay. his other friend. He friends. did you a favor. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. she said that he left because all she said was, oh, you playing with me. And he went ghost. Yeah. That's no. the thing he was showing you. He's playing with you. Yes. He confirmed yes. your yes. statement. Yes. Then if he not stayed and kept on playing, you'll not start crying. That's really not a question for the It's really not. He didn't say, nah, fam, nah. I'm trying to be honest. He left. He left. He just did. the answer. He's not the one. We hope you help to marry that. <laughs> back to the OR. Back to the OR. Back to the OR. All right, and our last question is from Fanta. Fanta. Fanta says. No, Fanta like the drink. Yeah. Okay. Mm. I hope she got a Coke bottle. Oh. <laughs> so Fanta says. Hey Cinderella, I am 19 years old and I've been dating this guy for over a little, a little over a year now. Okay. I'm a black girl and he's white. Uh, okay. 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 Yeah. I'm kind of here for that. The relationship has been going well mm -hmm. and things seem to lo be looking up. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Um, I met his family and everyone is generally nice, all except one. His Don't mom. Oh. His mommy. Every time I'm at his house, his mom is so nice to me, but the moment he disappears, his mom tends to be rude and say some racist remarks. That's real? Oh. I thought that was only a movie. It's what? called Get Out. No, no, that's real. It's, it's called Get Out. That's why I said, hmm. Anyway, I told my boyfriend about it, and he got into a huge fight with her. At least he stood up for you. Mm -hmm. She even accused me of lying, and le this led to my, my boyfriend uh, to question me. 
Okay. I really love him, but I'm confused on what to do. Get out. Yeah. Get out. Honestly, get run. Just get, get out. out. Oh, she's a black girl. He's Dude. a white boy. Yeah. Yeah. That's how. It, that's how she feels. Like. Yeah. And that's, she's not even giving you the entirety of how she feels. No, she's like legit like, letting you know that she's not here for you. Yeah. yeah. You don't want that to be like she the grandmother of your children. Exactly. Like, Ever. She's gonna put a bad juju or scotch. Honestly, she's not real. down for the yeah. swirl. She needs to swirl. Oh. <laughs> I like it. I like it. If that is starting in the dating phase, there's no what there's what there's what just imagine what marriage. More is marriage. If the mom's not here for it, it's not happening. No, that's how no. I feel. Yeah, I'm so sorry, girl. I've never been for people that like stay in relationships where the parents don't like right? you. Yeah. yeah. And those parents it. will become my parents. Exactly. So why would I be in the relationship exactly. if my own parents? You don't shouldn't like try me. to fight it or anything. No. Like you need the parents' approval. Exactly. Parents you don't need him. Parents. You don't need him always being pulled in two different directions. Exactly. Like mm -hmm. that's just, just not good. Yeah. 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 Don't stress. set yourself up for failure. Yeah. Exactly. exactly. And the caucasity <laughs> for her to not turn around when he's not there to not be talking. <laughs> that's that's it, honestly. That's, 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 that's crazy. No caucasity. He's a Word of the day. The caucasity for her to know you put two face on you. Caucasity is the audacity. Our fellow black people. Um, <laughs> Girl. So, so what is that? Is that non or verbal? Mm. You can use it in any way. <laughs> yeah, get out. Just get, get out of the relationship. It's, it's not worth it. Um, but um, yeah, we hope we helped you. What's her name? Fanta. Fanta. So we hope we helped you. Thank you guys so much for sending in all of the questions. And for the next asking for a friend, go ahead and hit me up on askcindyrella at gmail.com. Um, I'll leave all these beautiful ladies' information in the description box down below. Y'all make sure to check out all of them on Twitter, yeah. Instagram, YouTube, and Snapchat, and Gmail, um, on the Hard or Not app, Tinder, and <laughs> then, uh, MySpace. MySpace. Check it out, man. But um, we hope you guys, uh, we hope we helped you guys. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. And see more of these beautiful ladies, let us know in the comment section down below. Make sure to like this video if you liked it. Comment on this video what you liked about it or didn't like. I won't read those ones, though. <laughs> and um, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you liked me and everybody else here. So, hope you guys have a beautiful, um, wonderful day, week, whatever you're going into. Stay blessed and beautiful, gems. Love you. Bye. Bye. Hit me up.